Hi guy here. I'm going to show you how to uh, pipe the audio out of a uh, USB sound card for uh, your OP25 software. So uh, I I have my USB uh, sound card plugged into my Pi <clears throat> via USB. Uh, you can do this also with like a audio hat type thing. You might have to change your config a little, but with the USB sound cards, they're basically plug and play. So we have this plugged in, so we can go ahead <clears throat> and run the uh, run the following command here, and I'll throw a link in the description for all this uh, information on my website. Now I'm running the Pi 4 here, uh, but if you're probably running anything except for a 4, this might say card 1 other than card 2. <clears throat> but regardless, it doesn't matter. We just gotta get the right number. So we need to look for either if this is a 1 or a 2 and to see if this is a zero or a one or whatever, but more than likely this is a zero. So we need to know two and zero. And another way you can do this is type in the following. It kind of gives you the same information, but it'll list everything. And as you can see, you can tell how you get card two because the HDMI ports on the uh, <clears throat> pi in the uh, 3.5 millimeter jack and so on but regardless we just need to know 2 and 0 so once we're in the uh, directory here for the OP25 software let me make this bigger Now if I come back here and go back, now when you're running this, I mean I'm kind of new to this software so I'm still learning some things, but uh, you could probably get away with not having the uh, frequency there. And you definitely want to play with your gain a little bit, maybe even your sample rate. But regardless, we're not here for that. So. <clears throat> we're going to put a space there then what we can do is put a dash zero I mean O a capital O space HW colon two comma zero and now if we run that, obviously, I didn't want to run that command. Let me go back here and try a different one here. That's a command to uh, see what your uh, Q is. Might not have it here. All right, let me get it here. All right, so now that I have the more accurate one, let's go ahead and do this. So, dash capital O, H, W, colon, two, comma, zero. So now, when I run this, it will pipe our audio from OP25 out through the USB to your speaker or whatever you may have plugged into it but <clears throat> we need to make sure that we have the audio and stuff turned up on our uh, USB so to do that we're going to type in the following command here and click enter and it'll probably come up to your default so we need to <clears throat> do function 6 on our keyboard here 
Now we're going to scroll down and click on the USB audio device. And as you can see, here's our speaker. So we can mess with that volume. The microphone, you don't really need to mess at, but if you're uploading OP25, if you're piping it out through the USB and you want to upload it to Broadcastify, for example, what we can do is come out of the USB with a cable and jumper, jumper it right back into the microphone. So you would have to turn the microphone up <clears throat> also. And we're going to do, we're going to click M here once we have the speaker highlighted like it is because we want to disable the audio, auto gain because if you click on it you can see we want to disable that just like it is here and you can do that by clicking the M on the keyboard so now that we have this set up we can hit escape but now we want to make sure we keep that setting so we're going to type in the following command here and that'll uh, save our uh, USB setting so now your audio should be piped out through the USB uh, sound card and, uh, and it should be working for you now like I said you might have to play with the uh, volume a little bit but uh, you should be good to go Alright, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for another one. Don't forget to hit the like, share, and subscribe.